Sorry? Um, don't know yet. He's, um, I think he's probably the best of the three of them. Um, ankle of some sort, but he's, he's getting around on it. So, uh, mate, I don't know. Fingers crossed. Uh, more concerns, probably our, our biggest concerns are around Ciro and um, Kalepi. So with possible ACL, MCL, we're not sure. So fingers crossed. Yeah, it was. It was a great win, you know, and we certainly needed it against a pretty, um, a very desperate side. So I thought our first half, um, obviously set the set the win up for us. We were, we um, we did a lot of things really well. I thought our discipline was was particularly good. Um, we are trying to work hard with the referees to to um, you know with our ten metres and. You know, we didn't have any play the ball ones, I, I didn't think. But um, second half, it sort of evened up a little bit and, and was a pretty scrappy affair in the second half. But uh, just really happy we got two, two points um, coming off the back of, of last week. Yeah, I thought he was outstanding. I thought he... he um, yeah, he did what we all know he, he can do, you know. And if we can keep putting him in those positions and... Um, He's a very special player, and I thought the, the start to our game was really good. And all our best, our best players, Ches and, and Jake and, and Tom, and they all um, stood up and set the win up for us. Uh, I think the, the majority of the squad made were pretty. They're pretty easy with it, you know. I, I, there's a lot of young players in there, mate. They don't worry about too much at all. So probably more taxing on on Chez um, and, and myself a little bit. It was tiring. I was tired. You know, midway through the week, and I know Cherry was certainly fairly drained um, with it all. So it was an important day for us as a club that we won. And it was an important day for our squad that we won, and the only right of reply that I've got, the players have got, is to is to play well, and I thought we did that tonight. So that's what I'm real happy about. It won't, mate. It won't affect us um, uh, the way we play. Um, obviously, it's got repercussions elsewhere in terms of your you know your, your recruitment and. Um, what we can and can't do, but that's not the player's responsibility, and I'll, I'll do our best to shield them from it. Um, and we've just got to keep, keep trucking along. Yeah, it's um, not ideal. Um, certainly in the time I've been here, I can't remember something as big as this ever hitting the club, so, um, you know, it's just... It's just one of those situations where your only right of play is to try and win a football game, so... It's hard not to think about those things because it's a place that we all care about, from Trent all the way through to the playing group. So we take a lot of pride in our performance and the club that we play for. So I thought that was a good reflection tonight of how we feel about this place. And off the back of that, as a player, I can't thank our coach enough the way he sheltered it from us as much as he possibly could and took the, took the hit in front of the media, faced them, answered all their questions, and certainly from a player that's under him, uh, it certainly gives us, uh, you know, uh, a lot less on our plate to worry about, and a sign of confidence that he's got our back. <laughs> yeah, that's that's not ideal as well. Um, you know, I've um, pleaded my innocence through it all, and spoken as much as I possibly needed to to hopefully clear the air about where I stand on it all. But yeah, it's certainly not nice when your name's attached to something like that, and. I certainly wasn't surprised that they somehow found a way to put my name in front of it. Um, I like to think I'm pretty good at just uh, when it's time to train, I'm focused in on what we have to do and um, trying not to take my work home with me as well. So, uh, look, when you're sitting in the car, you know, in the way to train and stuff like that, you certainly let your mind wander and those things pop up quite quickly. But um, again, when I'm around the boys and out on the field training or playing, it's it's easy to forget. Um, there's too much to concentrate on. Um, 
Um, I've, I've probably found this year more than any there was times last year when um, Tom may have made an error early in the game. And this year, he obviously didn't have many tonight, but when he does make an error this season, he's flushed it and it's gone, and his next job and his next touch of the football is as good as, he's, as, good as it can be. Um, he's come a long way as a footy player and he's got so much more to learn. I'm really enjoying playing alongside of him, and when he puts on a performance like tonight, it's certainly, it's certainly exciting to watch. Have you noticed that Yeah, I think the... the Tour, the Kangaroo Tour, the World Cup was real good for him. Just, just being around the best players. So, and he's getting older, and the more footy he plays, he's still got a lot to learn. But no doubt that, um, you know, he's he could be anything. Turbo, um, he gets a little bit of luck with his with his injuries. You don't get too many blokes that are that big who can run like him and um, know where to be. So, um, he's a big part of what we do. But um, I thought he had some. A lot of um, teammates around him tonight too, as well, and you know his brother tosses up the same good stuff every week as well. So we're lucky to have the pair of them. Yeah, to be honest, mate, our coach um, he put the pressure on them to perform tonight, and I thought they responded really well. Our whole forward pack, Marty and Adam certainly set a platform at the start of the game, but you know our forward pack tonight, um, you know as as a pack were friggin' awesome and it was very easy to play off the back of. That's a real credit to them responding to the to the situation that they got put in this week um, by the coaching staff. Hadn't yeah. hadn't played the full first half and with the injuries we had it was a good effort from him and he's only young too, he's 20, 22 I think. So it was good for him. Thanks guys. Thank you. Thanks. <clears throat>